Good dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting this video, I would like to say something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. And although you have facing any problem or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. This is the question. A uniform but time varying magnetic field B is a function of time, exists in a circular region of radius small a and is directed into the plane of the paper as shown in the figure. The magnitude of the induced electric field at point P at a distance small r from the center of the circular region. Here we have given four options. Option A is 0. Option B decreases as 1 by r. Option C increases as r and decreases as 1 by r square. In this question, very interesting things is given that here, uniform but time varying, uniform but time varying magnetic field. What does it mean? Whenever we have to change the time, then magnetic field is also changed. And what is the relation of the induced MF and electric field? Here, the induced MF equal to line integral of electric field into DL. Okay. So, let us consider it is the first equation and another relation of induced MF and flux that is minus d phi by dt. Okay. You are all known that about induced MF is minus d phi by dt means minus sign shows it is against of this change of the flux. And what is the formula of the flux? That is B and A. Okay. B A magnetic field in area of cross section that is cos theta there is no need to the cos theta because it is perpendicular that time that b and a angle between b and a that is cos 0 and its value is 1 okay so therefore phi equal to b into a and differentiate both the sign with respect of time then d by dt b into a here you can see that and this circular loop their area is inside area that is fixed which is where the charges consist so therefore we can take constant term or coefficient term in outside of this differentiation then d by dt that is b okay and now we substitute in this second equation of this d phi by dt we get minus db by dt okay so it is the fourth equation now no need to show here minus because minus only shows the direction so, we can take in modulus if we have to withdraw this minus sign. Then, E is constant term. Then, uh, this is variable that is the length dl equal to here the induced mf a and modulus db by dt because we have to take an, all this result in positive. Okay. So, here the area pi a square db by dt and e and dl total length of this path that is varying path that is 2 pi r here the point p that is total length is 2 pi r we can check three conditions also but here no need because here point is located already p so therefore now pi pi get cancelled out here e equal to a square by 2 r db by dt and you can see that here r is greater than a so therefore e is inversely proportional to the r okay here correct option is e decreases to 1 by proportional to 1 by r okay i hope so you understood this question thank you for staying till the end of this video definitely for your success, all the credit goes to your hard work. But if my video will help for your success, then I will consider myself lucky. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye-bye.